just, you know, save some time, money, all the things, get you some of these. <laughs> What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Pri. Thank you so much for tuning in to today's video. I might look the same. I filmed two videos in one day, just FYI. <laughs> um, so if you haven't watched that one, go watch that one. <laughs> I'll have it linked somewhere up above or of course just go to the um, list of videos on my channel, which brings me to make sure you are subscribed so you don't ever miss any videos from me and you'll also know why I'll be wearing the same outfit sometimes. So yeah. <laughs> but anyways, as you saw by the title, I'm going over my top travel essentials um, just for just to make summer travel and any type of travel even better. Um, so I've done a couple of videos on my channel here where um, I've done some pack with me videos, but since it's summertime and I know everybody getting outside, I wanted to share just some top items. So just to keep with you and just to kind of have so you can feel more organized and feel like you're at home away from home. I know, you know, of course we want a vacation and stuff, but the worst thing that could happen is you forget something. <laughs> you don't have something and then you're having to borrow or go pay double for it and whatnot. So hopefully these little um, tips will help you. So make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it and comment down below if you have some of these items or um, if you wanna share some items that you may be using. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, so getting started with the first item we have khaki cube so um i swear by these i feel like they just make my life a lot more organized <laughs> because you know of course you can be the person that plans out all of their outfits for the entire week or however long that you're gone that's personally what i have to do so i don't overpack or you know you can be that person who's throwing stuff in a bag and you figure it out when you get there that's fine too <laughs> but it's also really really good to just have everything organized in your suitcase because then it's less, you're less likely to forget an item like a belt or um, an undergarment that needs to go with that particular piece, whatever it may be. So having the packing cubes just make your suitcase a lot more organized. Um, it stays that way even while you're traveling or if you like to hang your, um, your clothes up when you get there, totally fine. But yes, but these packing cubes are amazing. So these are by the brand CalPack. Um, I've had them for a while. I actually purchased mine through, I believe Nordstrom Rack. But of course you can still purchase them on the CalPack website. And I believe Nordstrom carries this brand. And then like I mentioned, Nordstrom Rack, I believe does still carry this brand. But yeah, but they are super convenient. So I got the pack, they came with five. Um, so we have like the really, really large one here. Sorry, they're kind of a little bit out of order because I of course used it. <laughs> um, so they have like a really large one and I like them because um, they're kind of like a vinyl material. So it's very easy to like clean them. I personally haven't washed these, which you cannot wash these. <laughs> so um, you have to clean with like a wet sponge and mild soap and then you want to towel dry it. Um, but since I only put like clothes in here and I don't ever put anything like wet and dirty, um, then it's fine. They don't get too dirty. I'm putting clean clothes in here. <laughs> so yeah, but I love that they have the zipper and then also love that it has like um, a mesh detail right here. So you can actually see what's in here before you go putting them, you know, go opening it. But yeah, may make my suitcase very organized. Um, I just feel like I, it saves space as well because you know, sometimes when you're packing clothes on top of clothes type of clothes um for one i don't want them necessarily touching my shoes but then it just kind of gets you know messy and whatnot so definitely get you some packing cubes you literally can find them in and everywhere and i feel like they are super affordable all right so kind of sticking in that little bit of the category with the packing cubes keep you some laundry bags in your suitcase so it's when i actually put my husband onto this because he was the person if there's anything wrong with this you know, you're putting stuff in a trash bag or you getting bags from the hotel or wherever you are and trying to stuff stuff in there. Or sometimes, unfortunately, you haven't put dirty clothes back in the suitcase and they just like out <laughs> contaminating all the other stuff. <laughs> so yeah, so I um, always love to carry laundry bags. So um, this one I've mentioned before on my channel, uh, my dad um, purchased this for me like years ago. I don't even know if this brand is still around. It's a um, Henry Bindle, I believe. They used to have a store here in Dallas, but unfortunately they closed down, but I feel like uh, maybe like Saks or some stores maybe still carry them. Um, but anyways, it's still just like a really good bag. I just love it because it was super cute. It actually came in a set. Um, I believe it came with like two other ones, like um, a little bit smaller than this, but I love the drawstring. Um, I ended up having to get another one because if you're gone for like a week or so and you're just changing clothes constantly, this is gonna get small real quick. So keep that one. I just purchased this one off of Amazon. I actually got one for my husband. It looks just like this, except his just says like laundry without all the cursive writing and in white. <laughs> um, but yeah, but I love it because it folds up like this. So easy to travel with. And then when you unzip it, 
it actually opens up into a somewhat larger drawstring, but I was a little sad when I opened it because I'm like, oh, this isn't big enough. Um, so of course you can always purchase, you know, a couple of them. Um, but it, like I said, it is super easy to like put it back together, but definitely keep some laundry bags with you. Um, and then this will just kind of help you stay organized, keep, you know, dirty clothes away, and then you're not having to worry about wet clothes, touching anything, smelling up your whole bag and whatnot. Just save some time, money, all the things. Get you some of these. All right, next up are some sleep essentials. So I always travel with a sleep sack <laughs> and a satin pillowcase. So the sleep sack, I heard you like, Brie, what's that? So purchase this from Bed Bath & Beyond. Um, I had stayed at a hotel one time, ended up getting like a bad reaction from the hotel sheets. So ever since then, I said I would never sleep under hotel sheets directly anymore. <laughs> so I ended up finding this sleep sack and it is super cool. Um, it's long, of course I can't really show you um, here, but I'll pop up a picture on the screen of what it'll look like. I actually just ordered a new one, but unfortunately it is not here yet. Amazon has been delayed a little bit. <laughs> so I'm hoping it does get here soon because I actually am traveling um, this week. This video will be up by the time I get back. Um, so I'm actually going to Vegas for a work trip. Um, so I ended up getting another one because I really like this one. I've had this one for years, but I'm tall. I'm five nine, and it's just gotten a little bit short <laughs> and whatnot. And I just feel like I can't really move around freely um, comfortably you know you kind of want to spread out and do all the things and whatnot so yeah so i ended up ordering another one on amazon so um once that one i'm hoping it gets here before i leave to go on my trip um it should but i will um leave um comments down below on what i thought of it um this one you literally um just kind of like crawl inside of it basically um so this piece is for the pillow so i could put a hotel pillow in here and not have to sleep directly on it but i do use a satin pillowcase this one is by the brand kitsch i believe is how you pronounce it um love it i purchased this one from ulta they ran a sale um so i got it half off and i love it because it's got like a zipper case um i had one that i loved from sephora and i accidentally left it in mexico the last time we went so yeah so i was a little sad about that one so i ended up replacing it but got this one um but yeah but with the sleep sack you literally like crawl inside like right through here so it's it's good but it's not very convenient because you got a shimmy so the one that i just purchased has velcro straps so i would definitely keep y'all posted on if i loved it or hated it <laughs> but it is available on amazon so i will link it below with all the other items all right so next up on my list is going to be towels <laughs> so once again hotel towels sheets all thing they just do not agree with my skin i mean i haven't tested it on my 31 year old skin yet but i got scarred too much younger years so i'm just like no we're not doing all that so y'all i do bring my own towels so i actually just got these which is why they're all wrapped up all nice in a bow um uh, target ran a sale where you got like this whole set for like 15 bucks so i was like you know what i want my own personal set of like travel towels so i know where my travel towels are i don't have to use our towels which is not a big deal at all but i just like that it was in a set they're black easy to just keep in my suitcase so when i'm whenever i'm ready to travel ready to go so um this one is by the brand threshold bath set 100 cotton so this um, is a six piece set had really good reviews so it did come with um i believe two wash cloths two of like the hand towels and two large towels so anytime i'm gonna be gone for like five or more days i do take two towels because you know i'm using one towel for you know a couple of days and another towel for another couple of days I don't know how y'all use towels. I know some people are just one towel a day and just move on. I don't get down like that. Do it how you want to. <laughs> so yeah, so I feel like for me being gone for five days, two towels is enough. And then I also got some more washcloths. So if you're not new to my channel, you know that I use a new washcloth every time I wash my face in morning and at night. Um, helps with keeping bacteria off of your face but because if you keep wiping your face with the same towel, there's bacteria lingering in there and that's what can cause breakouts and all the icky stuff. So I do have wash um, cloths. I have makeup ones that I will keep here. But like I said, I wanted a pack that or a set that I know specifically is for travel. Um, so this is actually on sale at Target for like three bucks. Um, but I think they regularly retail for like $5. Um, but they do come with eight. I have not washed these yet. So I'm hoping that they wash well and will travel well. All right, so the next two items are going to be more so for the plane, but they can also be used um, in the hotel as well. So first things first, I have um, a neck pillow. So I have been having one for a while and I think I washed the cover and the cover just never went back on right. So I got this one from TJ Maxx, but I loved it because it came with um, a little case. So even if you're not using it and you don't want it touching like other surfaces, 
while you're at the airport before you actually get on the plane, then you know you could just clip this onto your luggage um, and then just have it ready to go. Don't want to take it out because it is a little bit of a pain to put back in, but keep you a neck pillow. So when you're on the plane, you can just rest your head, not on your neighbor's shoulder, unless it's somebody that you know, <laughs> um, and just kind of help out with that. I usually just like to use it anyways, because I don't ever just relax back on the seat. So love the pillow. And then also keep you a blanket. <laughs> so um, I use this in the hotel because once again, I don't like sleeping under the sheet. So usually with my sleep sack and a blanket, your girl is good. Um, and then also if I get cold on the plane, this is also good. Um, this was a freebie, I think from Sephora. Um, so it's not huge. Um, usually I do take ones from um, Victoria's Secret. Y'all know they have their Sherpa blankets. Um, but I like this one because it's small and discreet. So it'll easily fit like in my carry-on like tote bag or whatever. So I'm not having to like take up too much space or, you know, have to dig for it. So yeah, so just keep you a little blanket and neck pillow so you're comfortable. All right, so this next item is actually for my fellow content creators or just anybody. Honestly, I feel like most people should have one of these items these days and that's not like a diss to anybody, but get you a tripod, y'all. <laughs> so um, this comes in handy when it comes to taking your own pictures uh, because sometimes you're not going to always have somebody there to take them for you. So you can set up your handy dandy tripod and you don't have to worry about asking a stranger to take one for you or have somebody else hold your phone or, you know, all that good stuff. So invest in a good tripod. Um, Amazon actually has one that um, a lot of girls have been talking about because it is very discreet and just easier to carry. This one's fine, um, but as you can see, it is a little bit bulky, but um, there is one on Amazon that I've got my eye on. I'll throw a picture up over here or on the screen so you can see it um, but very discreet very cute and I believe it goes up to 60 inches which for a tall girl like me it's a major win so yeah so if you are going on like a family vacation you, know, you want to have like family photos but it may not be other people around to take it and you don't want to leave anybody out definitely get you a tripod okay so next up will be your best friend so <laughs> um, if you like to keep your hands free while you're traveling you don't want to be digging through a large bag trying to find your id or your ticket or whatever it is get you a fanny pack y'all <laughs> so my husband actually kind of put me onto this um, because he got one when we took was our first trip I think it was our honeymoon, actually. Um, that was actually our second trip together <laughs> um, was our honeymoon. And he was just like, I need a fanny pack. He was like, I don't like having to like be reaching in my, because he carries a backpack too. He's like, I don't want to be reaching in my backpack behind me. I just like to keep everything on me, in front of me. I can easily get to it. I was like, you know what? You're right. So I actually picked this one up on sale from Target. Um, I'm going to try to see if I can find a link because it was like a random clearance, like online only item that ended up in the store. Um, but, you know, you can find a fanny pack anywhere. But love it. The best travel companion, I love like the different pockets. So for me, I keep like, um, you know, my wallet nearby, my phone, um, I'll keep hand sanitizer, anything that I know that I'm going to want to just have immediately, I'll grab it. So like AirPods and whatnot. And then of course you just keep this on, take it off while you're going through TSA. But yes, get you a fady pack. And it's something that you could even have even wherever you're going. If you just want to be hands-free, I know there are some places where they tell you, you know, like don't have something on your back or your shoulder, keep it on, you know, in front of you and whatnot. So definitely get you a fanny pack while you're traveling. It makes life a whole lot easier. Okay, so next up, moving into more so like the organization things, you want to have some makeup bags. So I actually have quite a few. So of course you have some different ones. Unfortunately, I can't find my square case. Um, I do have a large one, which I have featured in previous videos. Like I said, I'll have those videos linked somewhere up above. But I also had some smaller ones that I have planned actually to use on this trip that I'm going on soon. And they are nowhere to be found. So anyways, I'll improvise. If not, I have something to work with. But this one I purchased from TJ Maxx. I like it because it just has like the two compartments. As you can see, I've got quite a few different items in here. And now I'm kicking myself because I just repurchased some items. Go through your stuff before you run to Target. Because <laughs> that is me. I literally think that I don't have items and then I end up with like double of everything. So yeah, so use this one. Um, I also have a jewelry organizer, which comes in handy. It keeps your necklaces from getting tangled and just, you know, makes everything easy. Um, and then of course, you know, just any type of case to keep like makeup, skincare, separate or in, or even like your makeup brushes and whatnot. Um, just keep some makeup cases. And those actually recommend like carrying with you on the plane in the event that you need to freshen up somewhere or
or you know if your luggage gets lost then you can still have your stuff on you and whatnot so just keep that handy i also recommend traveling with a makeup um mirror so um purchase this one off of amazon i love it um i originally got it because sometimes if i'm traveling with others i don't want to take up the bathroom the whole time i like to take my time and i do my makeup so usually i just pack my little light here and I can set up like on the bed or um, at the desk somewhere and that way I can kind of do my makeup in peace and not have to you know worry about somebody kicking me out the bathroom so definitely invest in one doesn't have to be this big but I think it is key to have something so that way and even in the event that you aren't able to get checked into your room but you need to do a quick touch up of the face and you don't want a small mirror you got this guy Okay, so next up, I have a suitcase cover. Um, so if you have been following our couples channel, then you have seen this one before. If not, uh, make sure you go subscribe to our channel. Um, but I have this super cute suitcase cover. I just love her. Purchased her off of Amazon um, some years ago. Um, this usually fits like a medium-sized suitcase. I have gotten it to fit over a larger one, but you definitely gotta do some shimmying and all the things. But love her i feel like people won't lose her because you can't miss her <laughs> and whatnot so i always love to have this and then it's just easier to find my luggage because most of my luggage is black um and of course everybody has black luggage so of course you see her coming down the little turnstile or whatever and stuff you know that is breeze back <laughs> and then also to keep things organized i recommend getting a sunglasses case so this one is by key australia um some people might pronounce it quay but it's key <laughs> um but this one holds to four pairs of sunglasses um, and I just love it because it keeps them from getting broken and then they have like the little um, velcro not velcro like a elastic band here to kind of keep them in place um, and I just love it because then you can have multiple pairs keep them in this snug little case and take they don't take up a lot of space um, and then you don't just have your sunglasses just kind of like loosely out in your bag okay I have just a couple of more items um, so the next one up is going to be a shower wrap so I usually um, pack a robe um, with me but as of late I've noticed just when I get dressed I'm hot y'all and stuff so the last thing I want is like a long sleeve robe it is thin it's really good one I got it from Target once again y'all probably have seen it on my channel if you are not new here um, but I love it and it's very easy to pack but I just find that I'm like literally still sweating as I'm getting dressed and don't nobody want that especially after you showered and trying to cool down and you have something long so purchase this um, shower wrap from Target I actually have another gray one which I'm y'all have seen me wear on my channel but i purchased this one specifically for travel and um, they had them on sale recently for like seven bucks they usually retail for 10 um so still super affordable but yeah i thought it was cute it's got like little strawberries on it but yeah i just love it because then it's something that i'm still covered up and you know i'm not just completely hot with long sleeves on and whatnot so yeah so get you a robe or um, like a short sleeve robe or even just a towel wrap just something that you can have on if you want to keep you know tying up a hotel towel around you and all the things so yeah last but not least I have a charger organizer so this case I picked up from Target um, loved it has rock, been rocked with me for I think a year or two now but I love it because it just keeps all of my chargers organized it's not doing a very good job of it right now but it keeps it organized so it has a little um, elastic bands here where you can put like cords like this on there um, and then also it's got like a little pocket here um, I have um, just a battery charger to charge my phone or like any other device that I may have um, it's got the USB port but then it also has like the plug in here um, so if you have a USB port then you should be able to plug it in I know iPhone now y'all know they have the weird um, chargers and stuff so you will want to get one I have this one I also have the um, the MagSafe charger charger excuse me that clips to the back of your phone I really love that one too but if you just have any other devices definitely get you a portable one um, and then I also have an Apple watch portable charger because <laughs> y'all know if you don't have the latest and greatest watch that thing will die on you after using it for one day <laughs> um, and sometimes you know when you're traveling you may forget that charger or you're out and about and you really need one so this is really good purchase this off of Amazon love it um, I don't use it as often I could use it a lot more um, but yeah but it really can to have all right so those are some of my top items of course I do have more but I don't want to keep y'all all day so like I said just go check out those other pack with me videos because I did get very like detailed ways on how to pack your bag um, but then also um, just a lot of different things that I love to travel with I haven't changed too too much 
but like I said, I just wanted to have a dedicated video of just like my top items that I feel like everybody should have with them. Of course, take how, take what you want, <laughs> but um, just something to keep in mind. But definitely appreciate you guys tuning in. Uh, make sure you comment down below on any of your favorite items. If there's something that you want to recommend to me, would love to hear it. Uh, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you have enjoyed it. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't ever miss any videos from me. But I will catch y'all next time. Bye. Bye.